Game Center CX, CX Gemu Center Shi Ekusu, also known as Retro Game Master in other regions, is a Japanese gaming variety show television program produced by Fuji Television and Gascoigne Company. It stars Shinya Arino, a member of comedy duo Yoiko, who plays home console video games from previous decades and usually attempts to get the games ending within a single day. The show has been on air since November 4, 2003, with a new episode airing bi-weekly at Thursday midnight on Fuji TV One. Eleven DVD sets have been released in Japan. In 2008 Fuji TV was looking for international distributors for subtitled DVDs. Premise <inaudible> 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 The show is presented as a gaming variety show which follows a commentary-based longplay format. Shinya Arino challenges several games from previous eras, presented by his producers in order to get each ending. He is supported by the show's assistant directors referred to as ADs and sometimes other staff, both via moral support and actual gameplay. He also is featured in segments interspersed throughout the episodes where he goes to local arcade centers, as well as segments where he does a variety of things, such as interviews with game designers, showcasing classic console hardware or games, or a made-up game show where the staff participate. <laughs> game Center CX as a company Arino is presented as an employee of the Game Center CX company, which exists solely inside the Game Center CX universe. His jumpsuit attire adorns the Game Center CX logo, which with the second season onward lost the original brackets around the CX. Arino formally greets anyone of status by serving him, her a business card. The CX company even promotes Arino depending on how well he does during the season. The phrase Arino says right before turning on the console. Kacho on signifies his role as chief of the aforementioned company. To continue on with the corporate theme of the show, a stock certificate was included with the second DVD collection to have the buyers feel like they owned stock in the company. In the last episode of season 7, Bandai Namco Entertainment president Ishikawa made Arino an honorary employee and presented him with a company card. Topic ADs The assistant directors help provide creative input, construct settings, and work as camera crew at times, especially when on location. Their on-screen presence is typically precipitated by a Reno struggling with a spot in a game. They will offer help of a varying degree, enough to dislodge a Reno from his despair, but not so much as to raise questions about whether he beat the game on his own. These members of staff start as interns, and often they are promoted to various paid positions surrounding the show's production. Many have moved on to other Japanese TV shows. Naoki Yamada, Shan Tianji Shi Season 1, Shinichiru Tujima, Dong Dao Gen Yi Lang Seasons 1 and 2, First Episode Only, Hiroshi Sasano, T Yi Da Si Season 2, Shun Yurakawa, Pu Chuan Shun Seasons 3 and 4, Yuya Inoue, Jing Shang Yu Yi aka. Anoko Max, Anoko Max Seasons 5 and 6, later promoted to trainee director in the end of Season 13 Saki Takahashi, Gao Chao Zuoji aka. Meijin, Sensei, Ming Ren Xian Sheng Season 7 Takeshi Suruoka He Gang Zhang Ji Season 8 Tomoaki Nakayama Zhang Shan Ji Ming Seasons 9 and 10, left the staff in the 12th season. Hiroyuki Emoto, Zhang Ben Hong Ji aka. Amoyan Amoyan seasons 11 and 12 left the staff in the end of the 12th season. Akane Aitu Yi Tenchian seasons 11 and 12 and 13 Yuki Katayama Pian Shan Shangwei aka Katakan Kun Pian Kinkan seasons 13 and 14 and 15 now only appears in the Tamage segments starting the 15th season. Junpei Takahashi Gao Chao Chun Ping seasons 13 and 14 and 15 at Sushi Aitu Yi Dong Du Ji season 16 Gen Matsui Song Jing Xian seasons 16 and 17 and 18 left the staff in the 18th season Hideaki Yanai Shi Nei Ying Ming season 18 and 19 Ryo Asuka Da Shu He Liang seasons 19 and 20 Hiro Taka Watari Du Da Kong season 20 and 21 Yuta Kaga Ja Hiyu Tai season 21 and 22 Topic Miscellaneous staff Kuchi Abe Abu Hao Yi cameraman 
Masayuki Kaib, Chi Bu Chong Shing, art director, writer. Suyoshi Khan, Jian Gang Shi, producer, narrator. Yuichiru Suda, Shu Tianyu Yi Lang, video editor. Muneaki Tanizawa, Gu Zhe Zong Ming, aka Tani, Tani voice mixing. Kensaku Sakai, Ju Jing Jian Zuo, planner. Yuko Watanabe, Dubian Yu Zi, assistant director, left the staff in the twelfth season. Came back as director in 17th season. Tsukasa Nagahashi, Zhang Chao Si, assistant director. Tatsuya Fujimoto, Ten Ben Da Yi production. Topic: Music. Audio clips from the video game Kid Icarus, Guang Shen Wa Parutena No Jing are often used to intro segments with the king. The song used during Arino's arcade field trip adventures is called Yi Guo No Shireb from Heat Wave. The song during his trip north is Between the Expansive Sky and Large Land by Chiharu Matsuyama. The second and third seasons made extensive use of the soundtracks from the games Headhunter and Headhunter Redemption to highlight the show's dramatic segments. The show also frequently features popular music by contemporary artists such as Phil Collins, Jesse McCartney and Madonna, as well as music from film scores like Jurassic Park and Disney's The Hunchback of Notre Dame. <laughs> Game challenges Main games Note, an asterisk, asterisk is noted beside the episode number to indicate the episode's localization and release on Kotaku. Western titles in quotes are unofficial names Kotaku uses to refer to Japan-only games. First season This season featured a game series or game company as its main focus with Arino's challenge game as a secondary feature. Second season episode numbering started with Arenos Challenge Games being the main feature. Third season fourth season the season mascot changes from king to queen. Fifth season season was shortened due to birth of Arenos daughter. Sixth season the season mascot changes from queen to dark king. Seventh season the season changes from dark king to king. The dark king makes a brief reappearance in number 53. 8th season 9th season season was shortened due to Arino being hospitalized 10th season 11th season 12th season the season mascot changes from king to fallen warrior 13th season the season mascot changes from fallen warrior to king 14th season 15th season 16th season 17th season 18th season the season mascot changes from the king to elephant king 19th season 20th season 21st season 22nd season Topic. DVD exclusive challenges Each DVD box set released includes a game challenge exclusive to the DVD set. Most of these challenges were Famicom games. Topic. Video releases On June 23, 2011, gaming website Kotaku started streaming English translated episodes of the series. On January 13, 2012, Kotaku announced that their agreement to broadcast the show had ended, there will be no second season, and existing episodes will be removed when the rights expire. However, on February 28, 2012, Discotech Media announced via their Facebook page that they had acquired the rights to the 12 episodes shown on Kotaku and will release them on DVD. They are hoping for a summer release and the sales of the DVD set will determine whether more episodes will be released in the future. On April 24, Discotech Media announced on their Facebook page that the episode count will be 14. On May 17, Discotech Media set September 18, 2012, as the release date. So far there have been 16 DVD sets put out with the latest released in December 2017. Each one contains key episodes, game center visits and a game challenge exclusive to the DVD set. They are not season compilations. DVD box volume. 5 also includes Tamage in South Korea, by Economy Class DVD box volume. 6 also includes 
Game Center CX Museum Report Can Infiltration Report Revenge Challenge Legend of the Mystical Ninja DVD Box Volume 8 also includes Revenge Challenge The Genji and Heike Clans DVD Box Volume 9 also includes Southernmost Gaming Travelogue Revenge Challenge F-Zero DVD Box Volume 11 also includes Revenge Challenge Famicom Trainer Jogging Race Tamage in Asia, Director's Cut Edition DVD Box Vol. 12 also includes Tamage in Paris, Director's Cut Edition DVD Box Vol. 13 also includes Tamage in Vietnam, Director's Cut Edition DVD Box Vol. 14 also includes Tamage in Atami, Shizuoka DVD Box Vol. 15 also includes Tamage in Nagoya, Japan, Business Trip Through Regular Bus Topic. Segments Each episode of Game Center CX is made up of a number of different segments. The only segment which appears in every episode is Arena's Challenge. The other segments vary by episode and season. However, the episodes that appear on Kotaku omit these segments, instead focusing only on the challenge of the week. Topic. Media Topic. Video games At the end of the sixth season, it was announced that there were plans to make a Game Center CX video game. The game, entitled Game Center CX, Arena's Challenge, is for the Nintendo DS and was produced in a collaborative effort by Fuji TV and Bandai Namco Games. During the seventh season, certain parts of the show featured the development process of the game. The game was released in Japan on November 15, 2007, and in North America by Xseed Games on February 10, 2009, under the title Retro Game Challenge. A second game, Game Center CX, Arenos Challenge 2 was released in Japan on February 26, 2009. Xseed Games has stated that U.S. release of the game is unlikely, due to its predecessors not catching enough attention from the North American gaming community. A third game, Game Center CX, 3 Chume no Arino, was released in Japan on March 20, 2015, and is the first installment in the series to come to the Nintendo 3DS. Arino appears as a mystery mushroom figure in Super Mario Maker, which is unlocked by clearing one of his event courses added to the game on November 4, 2015. Topic: <laughs> Theatrical film. Game Center CX, the movie 1986 Mighty Bomb Jack was released on February 22, 2014, to commemorate the 10th anniversary of the show. Topic spin-offs and advertising Game Center DX starring another challenger Masaru Hamaguchi, the other half of Star Areno Kacho's comedy duo Yoiko, and featuring many staff of the original, began in 2015 to showcase contemporary Nintendo titles, such as the latest entries in the Mario Brothers and Star Fox series. Topic. Nintendo eShop exclusive specials On occasion, special Game Center CX programs were produced for the Nintendo Channel for the Wii. Later, when the Nintendo eShop succeeded the Nintendo Channel, additional specials were produced, such as a special where Arino and late Nintendo president Satoru Iwata interviewed each other and played Balloon Fight, which Iwata programmed during the early years of his career. <laughs> 